Breakthrough research gives hope to women and their fight against breast cancer. The study is expected to generate better treatments for the disease. SNN Local News reporter Grant Boxliner is getting reaction from area doctors and has more. Grant? Area doctors say this breakthrough research is definitely an important step to developing a cancer treatment. But as with a lot of this medical research, they say developing those treatments will take time. Medical researchers have identified four genetically distinct types of breast cancer, a breakthrough that could lead to better ways to treat this deadly disease that kills more than 35,000 U.S. women every year. We're getting to the root cause of cancer, so we're figuring out the uh, molecular and genetic makeup of these cancers. Dr. Alberto Rigi is the chief mammogram specialist who runs the breast care center at Doctors Hospital in Sarasota. He says the new research is an important step, but cautions it will take some time to develop treatments. Anybody's living with cancer today, this will not make any difference because there'll be quite a number of years before the magic bullets are going to be defined for each cancer. Dr. James Fiorica is a GYN oncologist at Sarasota Memorial. He specializes in using genetics to formulate treatments for breast cancer and other malignancies. And what this study says is maybe we ought to be using, instead of the standard chemotherapy for breast cancer, treat them like an ovarian cancer because their patterns of spread are similar to ovarian cancer. And we've always known that breast and ovarian cancers are sort of linked. Well, this is one of those studies that actually looks at the tissue rather than where it started. Screenings have helped women catch and treat the disease early, and doctors say the prognosis has gradually improved. But any breakthrough to fight breast cancer is cause for optimism among patients and doctors. And knocking this out is uh, it, it's a little way off. But, uh, you know, it, every day is a step closer to at least a, a cancer being a treatable disease instead of a fatal disease. One more note, this study looked at tumors from 825 patients. Now October, of course, is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and there are lots of events locally to raise money to help fight this deadly disease. Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News. Doctors also say breast cancer treatments generated from this study could include drugs already approved for cancers in other parts of the body.